So it's Sunday night and uh, welcome back to the show. It's the usual night where I usually get into the games room and play some games and uh, nerd out a little bit. I've got my Godzilla t-shirt on because I saw the new Godzilla film this week and it was fucking awesome. Ah, oh, so much, so much plasma breath and ah, oh, much, much kaiju awesomeness. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, I, I just, I've just dropped into sort of uh, give you a bit of a bit of something different. I, I was going to do my Gundam special this week, but um, I've run out of time. I, I wanted to slowly sort of film my process of building a Gundam, but it's taking some time. So uh, Gundam building is is, is is a slow, drawn out process. But um, we'll get to that real, real soon. But prior to that got something awesome for you. Um, do you like shmups? Shoot 'em ups? I do. Uh, Danmaku, which is a like, curtain fire, I think in Japanese for curtain fire, or bullet hell shmups. Uh, there's one that I've discovered um, a couple of years back on the internet. Now it's a freeware game called Blue Wish Resurrection Plus. Uh, it's a it's an independent game. Um, it's, it hasn't been. It's not released on any consoles at all. It's just straight. On the internet and it's free for you guys to download and play at your own leisure and you sort of think probably think oh you know oh, independent game it's probably gonna be shit like you know shitty pixels and stuff man this game is fucking awesome let's check out some blue wish resurrection plus <laughs> Resurrection Plus um, is an amazing, amazing game. If you like games like the uh, the cave shooters, like Doom Patchy, um, Musa Mishimi Sama, don't know. Pronunciation is pretty bad. Um, but yeah, games like that where it's just bullet hell, where you've got your ship and you're just guiding through. Like the whole premise of this game is to blow up everything in your path. Um, and dodge bullets like th this is the type of game where I usually have to get my glasses on yes I, I don't have glasses on now you I've put on glasses occasionally but this is the one where you sort of like your bullets swarming in just around you all the time and the the immense amount of bullets you, you've really got to sort of look very very carefully like the, my main point of focus when playing these games is um, when you actually hold down, you've got two types of different fires. You've just got rapid fire which you can move very quickly. If you hold down another button, um, it comes up with a little red box on top of your ship, which is the hitbox. Um, and you can really sort of focus in on that. So bullets will drag uh, around that sort of hitbox and if it goes straight through, bang, you're dead. But uh, you can really weave in and out of the, these these amazing patterns of um, bullets, and it is a lot of fun. Um, may not be for may may not be the type of game for most most players, but guys that like the the, the cave shooters, it is just absolute an absolute gem. Um, apart from the the really sort of um, upbeat sort of techno soundtrack, which is I've got to say the the soundtrack on this game is. Pretty cool. I'm not really one for sort of like techno and sort of trancy sort of stuff, but in this game it just seems to work quite well. Uh, it just it just gets you hyped <laughs> to, to to blast some alien ships and tanks and all that sort of stuff. But um, yeah, it just it just seems to work really well just to get you excited. And um, but yeah, <laughs> um, but yeah, cheesy Sandrax aside, it, it's it's a great little shooter and it's got some amazing boss battles. Um, some of the bosses are all pretty generic sort of looking that you don't have any huge bosses like you would have like say in Ikaruga where you have like the big 
big ships and all that sort of stuff. But you've got some pretty cool boss battles regardless. Uh, but the whole the whole basic sort of system is just to keep shooting and getting a combo. So you're always strafing left and right, in, in and out, um, <laughs> and sort of just taking out as many things as you can as they pop up on the screen. You can see your combo counter up on the top. Um, which will accumulate to your, your score. You've got your bomb button, which will uh, destroy everything on the screen, all the bullets, all the ships, and you'll sort of absorb all those points when you go into like sort of these gold sort of uh, gems, I guess, to absorb for extra points. Um, but yeah, the whole fun is actually weaving in and out of these amazing sort of patterns and looking at them. I mean, look look at this. I mean. Look at look at the shit that you've got to weave in and out of. It's just a lot of fun. Um, it, it, it's rife with different options as well. You can go into the settings. You can change the color of the bullets. You can change the speed of the bullets. Like you can see through now as I'm playing through, um, as all the bullets are coming, as they're sort of grouping around me, they're sort of slowing down and sort of going into these slow motions of like, whoa, look at that shit this dude's doing. Um, and it sort of it helps you through a little bit, but you can actually turn that option off, so it's just pounding down to you at full speed. So uh, definitely an option to select if you're more of a um, I don't know a, a, an awesome schmuck player, if you will, or a veteran schmuck player. But you've got um, your bombs that you can use to, as I said, if you get into a sticky situation, wipe out the whole screen of enemies and bullets. If you've just trapped in a corner, you just go, oh, I'm totally going to die. You can hit the bomb and you'll get through it. But you've also, if you retain those bombs, you can also get a thing called a shield. So if you get hit, it'll just go ching, and you'll get the shield option come up, you won't die. You'll lose, you use one of those bombs as a, like a shield counter, which will keep you alive and fighting for the next round. Um, but yeah, definitely a really, really cool game. You can save um, everything you do via replay as well. Um, which is really really cool. You can sort of like go back, do high score challenges, um, watch all your replays to show off to your friends, upload to the internet, um, things like that. So, yeah, it's it's a really really cool game for an independent title. It's it's a lot of fun and definitely worth checking out. So, without further ado, let's check out some Blue Wish Resurrection Plus. I'll um I'll if I can find a link, I'll pop it down below. Um, so you guys can download this. Um, otherwise, just type in Google and you can uh, just type in Blue Wish Resurrection Plus and you can check that out and download it onto your PC. Best thing to do is grab either if you've got like a USB joystick, um, you can plug that straight into your PC and if, you, if you're sort of inclined using a joystick. I've got a um, like a USB sort of, uh, looks like an Xbox 360 pad which I just plug in which I, I play with that which I use most of my emulation. <coughs> Emulation, <coughs> oh, I'm a bad man, aren't I know. But um, definitely worth checking out. Um, I hope it's something you haven't heard of before, and um, if it is something you haven't heard of before, I really hope you enjoy it. So um, if you're into your shmups, and if you're into your Dan Marco bullet, Dan Marco? Dan Marco bullet hell games, then definitely check it out and enjoy. Coming up next episode, I picked up wow i've got it's coming in the mail from japan i picked up one of my holy grail games uh, a game that i've loved for a long time but i've never wanted to fork out the money for it um but i finally obtained a copy at a, at a half reasonable price in this day and age um but yeah that's gonna be next episode i'm gonna try and figure out a way to capture that on camera um whether i use an emulator if, if i can I don't know, can I use that? I don't know. I'm, I'm not rich. I don't have one of those cool, cool ass freaking capture devices. Um, but yeah, I'll try my best to represent that game for you in, in video form. Um, but yeah, it's, it's going to be cool. So until then, I'm going to put up a bit more gameplay of Blue Wish Resurrection Plus. And yeah, definitely check, like, check it out, guys. And uh, enjoy. Cheers. Thank you. Bye.